Charles did want to see him, um, but he was told that he, the schedule wouldn't allow. And as you just said, this letter has emerged that I've reported on today, that it, uh, before he came over for Prince Philip's funeral, and obviously tensions have been running very, very high, yeah. and he wrote a very, very personal letter to him. Now, on the one hand, you could think, well, that's quite sweet, he's trying to mend bridges, but mm -hmm. let's not forget that what was said in that Oprah Winfrey interview. Now, Charles and William are still very, very hurt, I understand, by what was said. Of and there was a lot of allegations yes. uh, thrown out, and those things are not settled. It certainly wasn't the time to be settling those at mm. the Duke of Edinburgh's funeral. Um, now, despite the, the tensions running high, we do know that uh, Charles, William, Kate and Harry got together oh, for, for a couple of hours just after the funeral. I don't think anything was settled, but it shows you that there is potentially a chance for some bridges sure. to be mended. However, it's a long road back, I think. No, I hope so.